Alright guys, welcome back to the Tuesday night jackpot series. Today we're on Okima Lake. This is a big bass lake. I used to fish it quite a bit back two, three years ago. Lots of good fond memories out here. But you know, I've been out in a while, so I have no no real expectations, but uh, I just know that uh when I was out here a couple years ago, these fish love the swim jig. So guess what we throwing? Throwing the swim jig. And wait. See how that goes. We got a couple of rods. Got the top water frog, of course. We got the buzz bait. Got this buzz bait. Buzzing toad, actually. We got the Cinco on deck. Cinco hasn't seen a lot of action lately, but it's on deck. Uh, we got Pop R. Mega Mega Bass Pop X. Here we go. Whew. Mega Bass Pop X. We got DT10. Got some DT10s and a chartreuse spinnerbait. Definitely gonna undo that chartreuse spinnerbait. Definitely for sure. We'll see. Oh, there's one. Woo, got one. You're on the board. You're on the board, boys. That was easy. That was easy. You make. You make. <laughs> a little too easy. I must say, that's a little too easy. It's a little too easy. Down the banks. Ten seven five. All righty. Ten seven five. Uh. 
well, chatterbait. Little chatterbait fish. That was too hard. That was too easy. No, it's too hard. Thirteen and a half. Thirteen and a half. All right, thirteen, thirteen and a half. Thirteen and a half. Damn. You caught three? Two. Caught two? Like two big ones? No. Like two tens? Twelve? Twelve and a nine. Ah, I got a thirteen and a half and a ten. <laughs> uh, oh my goodness. It was like my first or second cast I recall when I was like, alright, but now we're talking. This little ten inch is not gonna make the cut. <laughs> it almost didn't take a picture of me, you know? Ends up being like 15 minutes until deadline. It's the only one I got. And I catch another one on Saturday. Oh no, I hate these days when you expect them to be biting real good and they don't. Dude, we've had overcast skies for like the last week. That's what I've been saying. As cool as they can probably be. 
Oh, the one I did catch was pretty fat though. Dude, I got two small ones. I mean like small ones. Small ones? Yeah, like a 10, 7, 5 and 13, 7, 5. Uh, yeah, 10, 7, 5, 13. Yeah, 10, 7, 5, 13, 7, 5. Yeah, I was thinking we was going to smoke them today, man. Like 20. <laughs> 20 is all right. Got humble. Woo. Yeah. Excuses. <laughs> no, I I don't even know what happened today to be honest. Oh, I caught him on try to be I caught him on Sunday. What? Yeah, open water. I was like, what the heck is going on? It wasn't chasing for me. I tried to bait the shit out of those bass over there, dude. No, the charming bite I got was like, I thought it was hung on a log. <laughs> I didn't think it was a bite. It started reeling it. It started moving. I was like, all right, I think I got one. But I did get one bat charming bite like that. That didn't, that didn't like completely missed it. Then when you throw it out, you're like, do, 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 and you go sign it. Oh, I'm just like, it's just a big one. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> I don't know what happened to that one. It could have hooked up on a turtle or something. But it's too crazy. Too crazy. Too crazy. I was like, yeah, I was like, I was like, damn, when we got out there, it's still sprinkling a little bit. <laughs> I was going to throw sinkles too, but I was like, nah. Was there a shot in your area though? There's a bunch of shad where I'm at. There was some fry. I saw some fry. Oh, you should. When I threw it and then they'll hit it and like woke up. We should have freaking thrown pink cinco. I should have set the hook back. I just kept on checking. Should have thrown a pink cinco.